Hello there, this is the Jonin Monkey, welcoming you back to the Donkey Kong Jungle Climber playthrough. And this time we're challenging the final level of Ghost Island, Panic Factory. And, I must say at the start, I really love the music for this level. Uh, I'm not 100% sure what the official title is. Uh, the only titles I've got for the music tracks are in this like big, massive rip that someone did. I've got to try and remember their name because I was really grateful for this guy. But anyway, in the zip fault, although for some reason the name of this track is Ayashigi, which I presume means something in Japanese, but I've got no idea what it actually means. So, if there's anyone who happens to listen to this who does know Japanese and this means something, please tell me. I would be eternally grateful. But yeah, this is actually a pretty tough level and it's kind of worthy of the whole Oh, the like Kremlin theme and name it's got here. This is a um, short Kremlin base. It's filled with really irritated traps and uh, contraptions like this. Yeah, it's these give they are belt ones are the sort of main feature of this part of the set level where you're constantly the yeah, where they're constantly moving as you're holding on to them. So hold on for dear life as. It's kind of hard to aim and time your jumps correctly. Like, yeah, as you can see there, I fell to my almost fell down to my doom there. So. Yeah, sorry, I'm uh, having uh, struggling to fit, think of uh, what to say here. Now there is a secret if you go that way uh, to the left past the signal, but frankly, I wasn't going to risk it. Now, after we've taken care of this critter. This next section, uh, to get through, you have to. Uh, this is a feature that you'll come across often. You have unscrew these. Well, to unscrew the screws, you have to hold on to them for a bit whilst going in the right direction. And as you can see there, we've undone one bolt, so that girt is about to fall down. Now we just need to. Once I stopped uh, swinging and bumping into things like a moron. We've got to go and find the last remaining. Sorry, I've only just it. It's only just occurred to me that Diddy's gone. No. Anyways, what was I saying? Oh yes, basically, he, he to, he, and basically all we have to do is unscrew this other bolt, and we can pull the girder down and move on. Ah, oh, good old video game heroes causing massive property damage <laughs> to all of this and bases anyway. Yeah. As you can see, there's a banana coin there, which is now being blocked off. If you want to try and get that, the best thing to do is to undo one of the bolts, then attempt to go after it, rather than do what I did, which was do the both at the same time. Oh, now this section. Oh, God. This is one of the many challenging sections in the game, and one I particularly despise. Yeah, as you can see here, this crane thing is moving, and you've got to try and stay on to it. It's, but if it was just holding on to the crate itself, that would be fine. No, you've got traps like this. There's a spiked floor beneath you. The crate's constantly rotating, so you can't stay in one place, or else you'll be pushed off by the other platforms it passes, or you'll be get killed by the Kremlings. God, yeah, and it occasionally passes through girders like this, so you have to crawl around all the other platforms in order to get back on it. So... Whilst I appreciate the creativity, the time and care it took to design a level like this, I despise this section just because it's so frustrating, especially when you're doing this the first time. And I wish I could say this is the end of it, but oh, there's another level later on in the game which forces you to do this in the harder version of this puzzle again. God darn it. Alrighty, we've now on back to Karul. And this is another music I love, but for some reason, this music title is simply Doc. That's D O C E K. Yeah, I don't get it either. Anyway, hey, Cranky's now asking what Carul well, wants the Crystal Bananas for. D and Carul's just say, well, why else to take over the world? Duh. He actually literally says duh here, in case you can't read the text. And so we're about to begin on the boss battle, which. Much as I love this game, this boss seems kind of ridiculous because, to be honest, it's more like a Sonic boss than a Donkey Kong boss. But you'll see what I mean in a minute, once we've gone through this Super Saiyan transformation! 
all the crystal banana energy thing, whatever you want to call it. You see, the boss is a giant robot, which for some reason is called the Mega Amp. I have no idea why. Anyway. Yeah, we've got, oh, got a small gem and another crystal star. Hooray, this will be useful. Okay, now... The, the key to defeating this boss is to unscrew the, the bolts which hold the protective casing together. That hides the big glowing red spots. And then by hitting them with a barrel of attack, the, the machine will take damage. Although, having said that, each the protective spot is protected in a different way. Hey now, um, this lever here protects uh, you know, one of them, like so. Now, the left arm is got on a machine gun, so you might want to stay clear, because if you stay in one place for too long, the machine gun will eventually choose the spot. The right arm doesn't have anything on it on the moment. Oh, and watch out for this. As much as I love this game, this is cheap. I've never been able to defeat this boss without using a crystal star like this at the end, because what he'll do is he'll jump up, as you saw there, and throw bombs down at you. Now, the game implies that there's a specific pattern and you're meant to just get the timing, but the timing is so small that if you make a single mistake or just react a tiny bit too slowly, you will die and start the entire battle again, which I just thought was... It's incredibly cheap, I'm sorry. But anyway, enough of my ranting because we're almost out of time. And that's it for Ghost Island. Join me next time when the Only Monkey, Donkey Kong, and the rest will travel towards the Great Chill Char Island. See you then.